Hello, welcome back. Bitcoin just announced its first half result. A very good set of numbers. Revenue grew 88%, profit grew significantly, and they are issuing warrants. Year to date, the share price is up almost 200%. However, it has dropped 27% in the last five days. The share price just got hammered, dropping 14% so far today. What is going on? In July, Maybank released a bullish report with a target price of 47 cents when the share price was 28 cents. However, they released an update after the results and cut the target to 29 cents. They cut the forecast and assumed full conversion of the warrants. Excluding the increase in the new shares from the warrant conversion, the target is actually 38 cents. So, is the result that bad for such a cut? Is this the end of Bingquan? No, I don't think so. Let's dive in and examine. Do subscribe to my Telegram group for more timely updates. The usual disclaimer is the financial performance on a half yearly basis. It is net cash positive for the first time. Gross margin has been improving very well. Profit before tax and net margin are also increasing. Growth is mainly from their infra engineering segment. It grew 141% year on year. Bingquan is benefiting from the revenue growth and margin expansion of its infra engineering segment. Profit from the infra engineering grew seven times. Margin has been increasing. They will be issuing warrants, three warrants for every 10 shares. It is a three year warrant. The share count will increase by 30%. The excise price is 22 cents. With the share price below 22 cents, it will be out of money. Let's look at the valuation. Share price is 20 cents. EPS for the first half 2024 is 4.3 cents. Exclude the one off gains and include the potential new shares from the warrant conversion. Diluted EPS is 1.18 cents. This is conservative as the warrants have 3 years to convert. If we include the first half EPS times 2 to get the full year EPS, PE is 8.5 times. PE is 6.5 times if we exclude the new share. This is low. The key question is can Bingquan continue to grow? Using Maybank forecast, they are projecting good growth. However, the PE assigned is low. Bingquan just have to deliver to justify a higher PE. In short, this is a good set of results. It has turned around well and is riding on circular trend. It is a S-Jack watchlist stock. They are working towards exit. They need to win two battles. Share price to trade above 40 million market cap for at least six months to exit the S-Jack watchlist and to trade above the Warren exercise price for the Warren to succeed. They cannot fail. The cost will be too high. To do all this, they need to continue to grow and prove the market wrong. That's all for the short update. Do like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.